I don't actually play a pinball table that's actually just like this. This is it's sort it's almost like a puzzle game, almost. This but one's not quite. This one's an interesting table because it leads to the only hidden table in the game. If you can get the ball to go off the top end of the screen, it sends you to another table that you can't select normally. And can you stay in that stay in the hidden table indefinitely once you reach it or? As long as you don't select away from it, yeah. Oh, okay, cool. It's a similar idea, it's just quite a bit more complicated by the bumpers. Can you actually um have make a table that has a hidden table in it? No, sadly. You can't warp you to another table, although you could have it off screen, I guess, and have a main table and a bonus side table that it's hard to get yeah. to. The the funny thing is, under in most other tables, if you manage to get the ball off the side of, or the top of the screen, it still counts as a lost ball. Except in Flip In, it uh, it sends you to ladder. Huh, weird. Now here's a question: okay. Can you have a portal that uh, is an infinite loop so that you can never leave, or uh, or your ball can never um, be lost on the table? Yeah, there's uh, actually you can you can have a, a track actually. Ah. I wonder what the advantage of it that would be though, because it, then it would just be an endurance run to see how long you can last uh, to, um, before here's, you get bored. Here's a trick. Or though. how quickly you could score, you know, the maximum in score. A short amount of time, here's the yeah. trick though. It won't let you record your score if you quit in the middle yeah. of the match, so you have to have a way to escape from it. Holy crap, there's a second one? Oh, wow. I wonder how far they go up. That is a very good question. That's interesting. It even saves which ball I'm on. What does this game have to ending if you go far enough or something? I don't think it does. I th it's just a pinball game, so I think it's just about scoring as many points as possible. Now this is an interesting table. This is exactly what you were talking about earlier, about it being just a track. Well, it's interesting that those wheels can be influenced with the D-pad. You gotta be fast. Yeah. Right. Gotta get in, gotta get in, gotta get in, gotta get in, gotta come on. Can you make this into a table editor, I wonder? Yes, you could construct this, yeah. Everything in this game was made in the editor, I assume. Yep. You know, if they ever made a, another Sonic pinball game, I want something like this to be in there. I wish there were more pinball, pinball construction games in general that? besides future pinball and, um, yeah. pro pinball, or not pro pinball. <clears> oh, dang. Oh, no. If you think you can't get in there, hit a safe state. I want to see what happens if you get to the center. You just get a bunch of points, I assume, or it warps you somewhere. Yeah, it probably warps you to a 
fifth hidden level or something, or third. Yeah, that's why I want to know. Send out. To another bonus stage? It got me sent to a table called Flip Out. Can you normally select these tables or no? No, you can't. Oh my okay, God. we definitely Stop. want it to go up to the top. Now here's a question. Um, can you actually design tables that link to each other in the editor or no? No, there is no mechanism oh. for that. Oh, so it's only something in um, that you can get on the default it's, tables. That it's an incredibly <laughs> elaborate Easter egg. <laughs> wow. Also, this Reach game only lasts playing, for one yeah. ball. If I lose the ball at all, it gives me the final score and quits. Should the safe state then? No. Uh, yeah. Oh, you did set a safe state, didn't you? Well, yeah. At least it saves your progress. So. Mm. Oh, God. I'm I'm loading a state whenever I lose. That's what I'm oh, doing here. He wants oh. to see how far this rabbit hole goes. I see. So if you. Oh. If, okay. This so if you, if you, okay, I can't actually restart it. Okay. Yeah, that's what I thought. Because I didn't think you'd say resume from the state the first time. So. Oh, so once you, basically this is an unlocked thing, I guess. Yeah, like, except if I were to go back to the menu and and select a different table, I would have to start all the way back from flip in, and then do the ladder and then do the funnel. <laughs> flip in, flip out. The flipper. <coughs> Almost there. Come on, come on. Uh oh. Amazing. <laughs> what the holy crap? Oh my god, what is this? What, what, what? I it get this like feeling that I'm Whoa, supposed what? to be screenshotting this. Wow. Amazing. <laughs> I haven't even seen it. people know about this. Someone else had to have found this, right? I don't know. I just wonder how far, how many tables this goes. Yeah. Yeah, and Like, exactly. literally none of these are in the actual table list? Nope. nope. You have to start from flip in in order to get these. Wow. I have to wonder, are there any other entrances to hidden tables in the other tables you can pick from? Whoa. Hey. Dang. Oops. Aw. Oh. Oh. This is less like a pinball game than more like a puzzle game. Yeah. yeah. I mean, it's cool. This isn't something you could do with at your daddy's pinball table or anything. But... Don't get it, pinball <laughs> table. Don't do that. easier to control this than it is to control the funnel. Because uh, literally you just press the yeah, direction that you there want was the like ball no, to go on the next no track. time for the funnel. So is the funnel like welcome to the machine? Basically. Actually someone should to make a uh, ROM hack of this that changes some of the music out with uh, Echo the Dolphin the uh, Welcome to the Machine theme. I'm surprised someone's ever done an Echo Echo the Dolphin pinball game. Ah, <laughs> damn it, I just lost well, both of them. At least in visual pinball or something. Wasn't there like one of those in like Sonic's Pinball Party or whatever it was? Nah, just Sonic and Knights. Oh, okay. 
There has to be a video for this on, um... Wait, do you actually have to hit all the, um, lights I would on imagine screen? what I need to do, yeah, is hit all the lights. Oh, crap. It doesn't pick up on that one. Or maybe it just fell out the... That's a hole, right there. Oh, Samba de Amigo was the other one. Mm. Yeah. For first <laughs> ball party, because I was like, I thought there were three. And I guess that was the third one. I'm gonna see if there's like a slow motion button in this. Is this fusion? I don't think there is. Yeah. There's there's like a frame advance, but that's probably too slow. Pause, frame advance, fast forward. Alright. Which ones are those? Pause insert. Is pause button. Yeah, insert is frame advance. <laughs> not like actually showing it so <laughs> So here's the thing, I can actually get the ball trapped here, and then I can save there as a measure of progress. Yeah. Now, as long as I can get the ball back there somehow. There we go. Wow, there is a... Hold on, let me look at virtual pinball and just see if I can find any videos on this. Are you getting, like, incident points for that? Can I, I get trapped there? I can't find any videos on this. Hold on. I must not be... Yeah, interestingly, yes. Although, since the point of this really isn't to get points... Sorry, that was terrible.
I am actually going to do some research myself. It has to lead somewhere else. They wouldn't have this whole, like... Secret levels. At the main menu, choose the enter code option under play mode. Honestly, um, doesn't really say much here, aside from how to just skip straight to them. How many hidden tables are there, though? Well, there were, there were like 12 cheats in there, 12-ish. that the last thing I hit, apparently. Which one? The, oh, okay. the peg there. The white one? <clears throat> the white one? No, that orange there's, peg a little there's toward There's an the orange left. peg to the right. Okay. Maybe that's... Seems like there are too many left, though, so... That's a good thing, at least. The only problem is that one there that's still flashing that you can see the white one, I have no idea how to hit that. It's way at the top, I'm assuming, is where the drop is. Yeah, that makes sense. Yep. Mm -hmm. Alright. There's still some flashers left, I think. There you go. Boy, so Fuck. much left. Oh, yeah. Come on, come on. Just right at the top there, it looks like. Yep. No! You were close, weren't you? Oh. I had it, and then it bounced off. Oh! Uh -oh. Are you supposed to get it in there, or...? Maybe that's what you need that extra ball for. Oh, shit. You might, yeah, you might have to do this over again. Wait. Oh. Uh, this is BS. It's <laughs> <laughs> okay. so funny. Uh, here now that I've got all the lights start, on. It's starting to become a masochist requiem here. Jeez. Imagine trying to do this without the assistance of safe states. Oh. Oh. I see. You're supposed to land on it in just the right way. Yeah. 
This might be why you need the extra bonus ball. Mm, quite possibly. Yeah, that's what it seems like to me. Because it's, it's not very obvious otherwise how they expect you to get through there. Well, he did relight the whole board. Maybe that's why you have to hit all the lights. Uh, I hit all the lights, and then once I hit the other thing... Yeah, that thing actually starts off. Okay, now I've got them all the, both trapped in here. Saving again. Not quite what I want. No. <sighs> no. Jeez. Oh. What happened to what happens to it? Ah. Is there just no way in there, or is there another trick here? I don't know what gives. I mean, it, it's opening for a reason. All right. Well, I think I'm going to polish this mystery off later. <laughs> <laughs>